I have quite possibly made my most challenging Pokemon Nuzlocke ever. I've taken Pokemon Fire Red and randomized it to where Wild Encounters are randomized, Legendaries are randomized with other Legendaries and other non-Legendaries so we could possibly get a Weedle or just another Legendary. Our rival keeps their starter but the rest of their team is randomized so every time we do a rival battle could be something entirely different. And a unique twist seen mostly on Soul Links. I will only catch one type per route, meaning no duplicate typings on the team. So, no more than one fire type, no more than one normal, and you kind of get the idea. Just make it slightly more challenging for me, but normal flying types are going to be considered primary flying. Just to make it easier on us, we can actually build a more diverse team, and so... If we run into a normal type, we can actually have a more better team. So. Our rival is also going to be named Taiga, because, you know, dragons, tigers, equals, you know, the equal strength and all that, so, and it just kind of fits the theme, so, yeah, yeah. But, hope y'all enjoy, and let's get right into the video. In the last episode, we took on the very spooky Pokemon Tower, fighting and beating our arrival, knocking out our encounter, which was a Jinx, and then fighting some more trainers before we met Marowak's ghost, setting it free to move on to the afterlife. Then, after we fought some Team Rocket grunts and rescued Mr. Fuji, he gave us the Poke Flute allowing us to wake up a couple of Snorlaxes, which then, after we went back to Celadon, losing our Larvitar encounter, we fought, but unfortunately had to run away from our Moltres encounter, the first of the two Snorlax encounters, before going back all the way to Viridian City and catching ourselves a Mr. Mime. So, let's keep this amazing streak going. Like if you enjoy. Hello, YouTube. It's I, Dragon Team. Look at Dragon Team TV streamer. How's it going? Hope you are having a great day so far. Hope you had a great Thanksgiving as well. Uh, which, by the time this episode goes up, Thanksgiving would have happened almost a week ago. So... Hoping y'all had some some great food and spent time with your family, and also if you partook in uh, Black Friday and Cyber Monday. Hope hope it all went well. If you went out for Black Friday, hope you stayed safe and all all that stuff. And uh, if you did, you know, Cyber Monday. Hope you got some good stuff, cause uh, boy, is it is it crazy out there right now? But not as crazy as what's gonna happen for tonight or today's episode, whichever, whichever one. Uh, because if you saw the little intro, last episode was just kind of just a very, very chill. Just kind of all we did was Pokey Tower, trying to get some encounters, which yeah. Kinda still bummed that uh, we didn't get a Larvitar or a Moltres, but hey, we got a Mr. Mime, so that's, that's it's something, you know? Even if it is not much, and I mean, Mr. Mime can still be useful later on. Who knows? We we can kind of uh, hope, hope, for, hope, just hope for the best. Hope for the best. So. We're going to be doing the good old cycling road uh, for today. So let's fly back to Celadon. Because could, could we go in the, the long route and go, and go down from, uh, from Fuchsia, not Fuchsia, Lavender Town. Could go that whole route and just do all that stuff. We could. We could. 
also, I just remember we can actually do the other Snorlax encounter. Uh, okay. Which, if, if the other Snorlax encounter is another Moltres, I'm going to be sad, but at the same time, cautiously optimistic. Simply because if it is another Moltres, it chances are we probably won't be getting anything good. I mean, I, I think Moltres is good. It's just gonna be very, very difficult to catch it. Oh yeah, I forgot we didn't battle any of these. That's right. All right, let's just uh. Let's just speed through these. Okay, wrong. Ooh, that can actually help us. Ooh. Also, wasn't there like an like a one of those aids up here? Yep. Do you have anything good for us? Oh, the item finder. Okay, yeah, we don't we don't need that because we're not really searching for items or anything of importance. I'm not gonna sugarcoat it. This is horrifically bad. I mean, I'll catch it in the event that we'll need it later, but. Now, why, why couldn't Moltres be this easy? I mean, come on. You are going to be named useless, because overall, you are literally useless. You get nothing good. Like, over the, overall, you, you, you get nothing good. Uh, actually, yeah, that's... Well, we'll save this whole spot for later. Uh, there's gonna be some encounters we can do. Uh, so we'll probably save that for after we get done with Fuchsia. Because then, then we can have a, you know, a pretty, pretty heavy. Where's the map? There we go. So yeah, after we do Fuchsia, because we're gonna go to, uh, Cinnabar anyway. Uh, so we could probably do a can like a can right here, I think. Do one down here. So yeah, we can actually do... Because we already fished. So we have that one for that route, so... We did 13, 15... We'll, we'll also save uh, the Safari Zone for for later because that's gonna be a whole thing of an encounter. Gotta get, I think, Surf, Surf and Strength because we're gonna need both. Uh, 
Yeah, because we got a lot of encounters, including the legendaries, uh, Articuno and Zapdos at the power plant. Uh, so yeah, next episode will be a lot of encounters. Even if we just do 15... Yeah, we can do 13, 14, 15, 19, Safari Zone, 20, 21, Mansion, and then Legendary. So yeah, we can do a lot of encounters. Alright, we'll go, we'll go with that. I'm gonna save a lot of encounters for, uh, next time. We're gonna do this encounter since we're here, and we might be getting something good. Okay, this is not what I was expecting. Should've ran. I... I, I should've ran. Okay, and the fact that I didn't... Annoys me. I... Should've expected it... To explode... Right out the gate. That's upsetting. Well, there goes our flying mon. Which... Guess what? Opens up both flying and normal if, uh, if we need it. God, I'm so upset at myself. I mean, looking at it objectively, I probably shouldn't have gone for it. But I I figured, oh, I could probably risk it. I can I can hopefully get a hypnosis. Cause I, I don't think uh Thunder Wave was gonna do anything. I mean, Thunder Wave probably could have landed, but even then, it was too big of a risk. I, I should have ran. The more I think about it, I, I just should have. I just should have ran. Ah, uh, fuck. Well, that's unfortunate. I mean, to be fair, though, it we can put not to on. Teach it fly. And, and also put Psychic on the team, which we don't have. Alright, let's, uh, let's get... Let's get you leveled up now. Probably 30. I 
And we'll just do that. Alright. Alright, uh, not to shoot people, uh, we'll zot to now. Uh, should be able to know. Fly. I can. Good. Uh, uh, uh Night Shoot could actually be good. Teleport. Hmm. Yeah, we'll get rid of Leer. Uh, any other. I mean, Ale. Ace instead of Peck could actually be good. You are going to be a, a special boy, and you are just going to be good for us. All right. Well, after that disastrous start... I think I should be able to bypass some of these. God, thank God we got past that. Oh, holy fuck. Good on you, my guy. I did the same as well. I did the same as well. Go to every grass, check every encounter. We didn't do more damage. Because if you would have endeavored in the quick attack, it would have killed us. Okay, he is. He is setting up. setting up. I mean, luckily we're still faster somehow, so as long as we don't fire punch, we are good. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna heal, and then, then we'll come back. We'll come back here. Uh, do that encounter. I'm kind of debating on whether or not to take on the gym. And we'll have to do... We'll have to fight trainers in the gym anyway. In the safari zone, can be tacked onto the encounters. Cuckoo! Or, you know, caca! Caca! I have got nothing to worry about. Level 34 Cascoon? Holy crap.
I, I do, if we do take on the gym, I need to look at what, what level uh, Koga's ace is going to be. And then just kind of just uh, level everyone up to that. How did, how did that mess? I mean, I probably could have just de-rage. Just same, same issue or uh, swap out to Human Torch. I mean, might as well just fight these, because I, I, I'll probably just forget somehow. And, uh, run into them anyway. Ooh, we don't want that. Alright, alright, Nat 20. Be, a, be our lucky fucking whore. Come on, Miss Evil, come on. Come on, I know you can do it. I believe in you. Okay, I, I thought I clicked on something else. I thought I clicked on Shockwave. But good to know Polyrath has uh, Water Absorb. Okay, that's, that's cool. That, that's good, good to know. Oh, you are such a bitch. Turn one, wake up. Fuck. Alright, turn two, wake up. Fuck. Turn three, wake up. There we go, noise. the hell really nah, thing that really sucks is that Zatu doesn't have any psychic moves yet Hariyama can't do shit against it. Ooh, you are a speedy, speedy boy. Now, if we can get the confusion as well, that's... Oh, never mind. Okay, uh, pretty much, okay. Fuck. Wait, we, we have to... Okay, good. Good. Because the longer we stayed in, 
the, the worst it was getting hit. Alright, we'll, we'll, we'll heal up, and then we'll come right back here. Because, oh boy, that was very... Very risky. Okay, the heal up there. We'll do this encounter because we're here. I know it said we'll save it for later, but we could do what was it? 13, 14, 15, Cinnabar, Legendaries. There's what, like 19, 20? And also 21? Uh, okay, we probably did 12, 13, 14, 15, 19, 20, 21, Legendary, Oh, we also got the fossil that we can do as well, so, yeah, we can do a, a lot of, uh, a lot of counter. Alright, please be something good, I beg of you! Marowak ain't bad. Good. Hey, we don't have to do anything to it. Nice. Uh, it gets... It only has a bone... Was it bone rush or whatever? So, that right off the bat... you good. Very good. We could theoretically put that on team. Have it replace someone else. But, uh... We'll, we'll, we'll save this as, as a backup. We'll save this as, as a backup mon. Uh... Hmm... Is what should we name you? Ooh, ooh, we can name you Gara. Here's why. Here's the reason why we're naming Marwa Gara. A, out of most of the characters in, in Naruto, I think Gara is probably the, one of the, one of the coolest ones. Even though I don't watch Naruto, ever. I mean, I, I have seen it, but I don't really watch it, watch it. But from what I remember, I, I still think he's still good, like, regardless. Uh, and also the other reason is because... While I load up and see what level... Uh, My level, uh, Zatsu learns, uh, a psychic move. But yeah, the, the other reason why I, I named it, uh, Gara is because it's the, uh, Japanese, uh, pronunciation. Or Marowak. It's like anyone that uh, watches the watches like the Pokemon anime uh, subbed. Anytime Marowak was on screen, it would always go uh, gotta gotta. Uh, oh my god! You are shitting me right now.
Sato doesn't get any good moves until way, way later. So we, we have to find... The TM. Uh, for Psychic. Because otherwise, we won't be learn. It won't be learning it until 65. Damn, they did you dirty in Generation 3. Holy crap. So... Okay. Zatu is going to be our flying mon for a while. Which I think the only way we can get Psychic is when we take on Sabrina. That's gonna suck. I'm actually debating of... Uh, actually... If you, go in, if you run into a Gengar or any other ghost type... Uh, it's probably gonna have levitate. And then we'll, I mean... Even, even then, we should be able to cover any weaknesses ground is gonna have. I'd say we risk it. I, I say we just risk it. Uh, so really quick. Let me see, uh, what... Um... That's Gen 1... Oh yeah, not to mention... This might take a while, so we're just gonna just do a, a quick little cut while I do all this, and we'll be right back. Okay, we back, we back, and I, upon leveling everyone up, uh, I actually misclicked and we got uh, she made towards the 44, which it'll be fine, it'll be fine, uh, because it's not gonna be overly leveled. You know, that was just a misclick, misclick by me, so if I can avoid using it, I, I totally will. Uh, but in the process, uh, we did get some pretty good moves. Uh, not, 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 not 20, uh, has future sight now, so we can, we can just do nightshade, get the guaranteed damage, which is fucking amazing. 
Uh, and then win. And then future sight can hit. That'd be uh, a good. Uh, Miss Evil now has confused ready instead of supersonic, so it'd be guaranteed confused. Uh, so that's good. Uh, Human Torch has both Sunny Day and Flamethrower, so that's gonna be just good on its own. Uh, I, I was debating on having Hariyama learn, like, Smelling Salt. Because, like, we could paralyze with, uh, Dragonair and then just swap in, uh, and do it. But, I think Moveset here is good enough. Uh, and then, of course, Sephiroth finally evolved to a Slacking. And it now has Counter and Flash for replacing... Encore and Mega Kick. It's, well, Mega Kick is like really good, really strong, and all that. 75 accuracy, and I and only five PBs was like very, very risky to use. So we just swap them out. So I think this move set here is good enough. Uh, when we get Strength, even better. Uh, and then of course Papa Dragon is still the same. Uh, only thing that's gonna suck is Truant. That, that's gonna be the only thing that's gonna suck. I, I was hoping we can try and get his hidden ability, but, uh... Yeah. Yeah. So, uh... Sephiroth, from here on out, is gonna be a ticking time bomb. Which, if, if we somehow do lose him, I probably won't be that upset. Because, yeah, it's just a slacking. It, it could be good. But at the same time, though, like... Hmm. So let's uh, just quickly take on on the, the gym. Well, we will obviously have to fight some of these, so like I'm not that worried about it. <laughs> and that's why I took off Super Sonic. Because if we were to use that at some point, it would have not gone well. Right, so there's there's a reason why I, I stayed in. How are you missing? Because, uh, because if we would have used like a dragon type move against it, uh, we could have done more damage. But yeah, I, I just didn't want to risk it. Uh, yeah, we'll swap. Swap on over to uh, to good old go. Hi. And this way, we can pick out. Get some, get some decent, decent damage. And we can just arm thrust it to death. Uh, Ninja Ask. Oh yeah, I need to see about uh, healing items. I 
Okay, we should be able to resist this. And just, uh, twist your last minute. There we go. Torcal! Okay, Torcal. Be able to just water pulse you. Get you knocked out, hopefully. Oh, I got the confusion. Oh, if I can hit her, please, please, please. Damn it. Oh, of course you protect. You, you just had to, you just had to drag it out. Just, just had to drag it out. Okay. Uh, I mean, we could have swapped into Demon Torch also to gets knocked out, but... Ooh, baby, I crit! Alrighty... If I remember correctly, I think... I think we have to fight him. And then we just go down and right there, alright. That's right. Come on and slam. Later, meow. Oh, the adorable little peach. I'm sorry, but I will have to murder you. Murder? Oh, don't charm me. It's not gonna do anything. Because you still have to die. Ta-da! We're here at Kogu! Okay, uh, we should be okay. Of course I'm gonna challenge you! Why would I? Like, why, why would I not? I mean, you're not gonna have poison types, but, uh, we'll, we'll just see how this goes. You have four. Abra will be slightly, uh, worrying. Ha! <laughs> Never mind! Never mind! I, I don't know why I was worried about it. I'd like, I, I mean, sure, it, it, it probably have psychic or something, you know, deal uh, adequate damage. <laughs> no. Uh. Okay, so let's grab the Miss Evil will easily counter this, uh, the Cedra. Yeah, this blends as a crit or even like, like, oh my god, never mind. Crit didn't even matter. Uh, yeah, we'll just stay in with the, uh, with low 10. The Shockwave right again. Dead. This one should be technically his ace. I mean, you're you're only making me stronger. <laughs> Someone call an ambulance, but not for me. Oh my god, we. Oh my god, this is. This is free. This is totally free. So yeah, the only <laughs> only thing we really had to worry about was Abra, but Abra went down so quickly, and then everything else was just weak to ele like electric. 
Okay. <laughs> well then. Well then, uh... This was a hell of an episode, so... Badge number five. Let's go. Still sucks that we unfortunately lost, uh... Harvey. Because that one was all on me. That's... Oh, I'm, so, I'm so annoyed. I'm so annoyed at that. Which, honestly, I'd say... Because of my stupidity and losing... Our, our flying mon. Uh... And it kind of opened the way to, for us to get, uh, to get Nat 20 on the, on the team. Which, honestly, if we look at the bigger picture, it, it probably would have been, made more sense, would have been a lot better to have Nat 20 on the team. Uh, simply because they're both flying, they're both get stabbed, flying anyway. Uh, they're both probably going to learn psychic moves anyway, and... So... It probably wouldn't make sort of more sense to put it on anyway, but... I, I, I want to put Harvey on in this, in that situation anyway. But, yeah, I got no one else to blame but me for, for that mistake. Uh, that's unfortunate. But, despite that... We got we got a uh, encounter which is uh, Marowak which we might use later actually, uh, depending on on situations. But you also got badge number five. So now, up uh, the uh, layout should have uh, changed by now, and uh, yeah, we didn't even have to use. Uh, I don't think we had to use. Uh, human torch at all during any of that no no we, we, we definitely use it once <laughs> I know we did we use it once uh but yeah it's like in, in, in the event that I do go to rearranging them up like I, I will do my best not to get over leveled. Uh, cause I did want to try to keep it to at least the same level as their ace. Uh, which in this case was 43 for Koga. I'm not, I'm not sure what it is for, uh, Sabrina. Uh, but now, if we wanted to, we could actually fly back there. Actually, that's not a bad idea. Uh, now, no, we'll, we'll, we'll stay here. We'll stay here stay here and because this way when we start off next episode we can do safari zone uh we can do all the other encounters we just next episode will be a heavy heavy encounter so uh yeah yeah i think uh, that's gonna wrap it up to for this episode so Thank you all very, very, very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this episode as well. Leave, leave a, leave a R.I.P. for good old, good old Harvey. They, they will forever be missed because of my stupidity. Uh, but if you watched all the way through, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Leave a like, comment, sub for all, all that good stuff. Hope you had a great Thanksgiving. All that good stuff and. Uh, yeah, I will catch you all in the next episode. Peace. Thanks for watching. Love ya. Bye.